How's that? I love it. This cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own, doesn't it? Uh. Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the new spirit fairer. Happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Francis. Intrepid Otter is a medium-sized boat that will make you slip away and stuff. Oh, guess. Ooh, yes. That's what we wanted. Oh, this. I thought it, that might be it. Oh, what is this? The dragon. I guess it's inevitable that it would be here. Follow. What else have we got to go? A foundry, which needs coals and oak planks. All right. Let's go in the sawmill now, because now we should be able to get some oak planks. Probably using this thing. Shove them all in there. Oh. Oh, we got a... Trimmer? Nice. Wait, hold on. That... I just still got maple logs. Hey. How does this work? I don't know. It didn't seem to do anything, did it? Let's go out and back in and see if I can use this again. Nope. Maybe because it's night time? Let's set sail somewhere where it's not raining, though. What's that? Let's go there. Oh, don't wake everyone up. Ring the bell. Wow, this looks amazing. Thank you for helping me out, Stella. The sawmill is so big. What a beauty. There's just one problem. Now don't get mad. I don't have any money to repay you. I guess that's why they call it a favor. You see what I did there? Thanks again, Sprout. Are you going to call me now, Stella? You're doing it all wrong. Let me give you a hand. When you're cutting logs, you need to make sure your measurements are accurate. Then you cut. Measure twice and cut. You just need to keep your saw blade steady and on the cutting line. If you don't do it properly, you'll end up losing a pinky or an arm or something worse. And a hit from the old hammer for good luck. Give it a try now, you old rascal. Alright. Ah, I see. That's why the sawmill wouldn't work before. Because he had to be here to help us out. One more... We've made it to Garino Fields. Garino Fields are discovered. Let's see what they have. Look at that. You did great. You're ready to start cutting wood like a champ. Just remember to be careful with this sawmill. Don't go and mess around with dangerous saw blades. Just because you've got leftover wood does not mean you should cut your hand off. Cool. Stella. Stella, I've got to tell you. There is something I'd stumbled upon some time ago, and up until now it didn't seem that important. Brace yourself. Remember my parents' manor on the lake? As weird as this sounds, it's not too far from here. Mm. Yes, I know. It makes me wonder about this world too. I must admit I've been actively trying to avoid it. At any rate, it's become hard to ignore. As I've spent much as I've spent much time with you here, I think I'm ready to tackle this mm. challenge. I'll probably only find regrets and sorrows there, but it's worth a shot. I've added the location to your map. I'll be ready whenever you are. Cool. Villa Maggiore. Nice. Well, I'm going to explore this island quickly. Oh, a visitor. Welcome. Are you here for our world-renowned Figaro tours? Of course you are. You're holding our brochure. The tour is about to start. It takes about five minutes and covers the history and flora of this island. After, you'll be able to tell your friends about it. Don't worry. There's no gift shop after this tour. Ready? Let's go for this five-minute-long tour that they have. Let's start right away. As you can see... This island doesn't get many visitors. People tend to focus on big city attractions. Here it's peaceful and quiet. That's something you'll notice with the fauna. Rice patches and a healthy forest are its main attraction. Moving on. Don't get too close. Oh, I will try not to. Over here. The rice production here is quite incredible. Workers harvest around the clock to feed local families. Right now, no one is around. I am not sure why. Sometimes I play in them when I'm off duty. But that's beside the point. Off to our next stop. So where is everybody? Why is the, uh, this 
island not get many visitors. Why do you not want me to get too close to you? Questions, 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 questions. All right. You can feel the humidity. I mean, really feel it. This oak forest really gets to me. We have a connection, a strange connection. I tend to skip this part of the tour, to be honest. If we could move along, that'd be great. Speaking of which, this fortune tree is the centerpiece of the whole island. We are not sure when it was first planted. People from all around the world would travel here and leave little messages. Anything to help with their lives. All right. This concludes our tour. F Fergo Furogawa Tours is grateful for your participation. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again for your presence. If you'd like to leave a tip, that would be appreciated. I recommend something along the lines of 50 glims. Yeah, sure. That's amazing. I knew I struck a chord with you. I'll sign you up to our upcoming tours newsletter. You'll have an educational great time. Thank you for your kind spirit. Cool. Achievement unlock more than 15%. Alright. Wow, berries. These look incredible. Just... Here, have some food. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep them coming. I can't get enough of it. <laughs> get these berries. Shear the sheep. Can we shear the sheep? No, I can't shear the sheep. But that's okay. What's down here? Nothing. Oh, there's something here. What's under the water? Woo. A citrine. Citrine. Nice. Whatever that's for. But I guess it's time to leave this area of the woods with our oak plank oak wood that we've got. Turn it into oak planks, I guess. And then build something out of it. Hey Stella, as you know, I tend to get hungry. That's just a fact of life. Sometimes when I do, I get hungry for really specific things. Your Aunt Viv would call it laser focus tummy. Don't get me wrong, I still eat pretty much everything you put in front of me. I'd just like you to put effort into this one. I'll give you a shout when I get a craving. Hopefully I won't ask for anything too extreme. You never know with this appetite. Fair warning, Sprout. Sprout, you've been chopping it up in the sawmill. I like it, getting the work done. Learn a new skill. Now that you've got my some materials, maybe you could build me a house. Let's get something real quick. Look, it's nothing fancy. It's pretty basic with a few hinges here and a few nails in there. Oh, you've already got some materials to build me something nice. I'm asking not only for me, but for the crew. Apparently I snore at night. Loudly, according to your friend, Gren. <laughs> What, a, what is a tools workshop? We need 30 maple planks. That's a lot of maple planks. Everyone's wanting me today. Hey Stella, you know me. I could always go for a little snack. Something salty, something buttery, something with flavour. Oh jeez, you know what? Just perfect. A big old bag of popcorn to myself. Just go ahead and heat me up some corn. Mount Toriyama discovered. Excellent. Excellent. We've made it to Mount Toriyama. A word, please, Stella. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've been very tired recently. I'm afraid to say that it's starting to weigh on my morale. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I think the guest house, as lovely as it is, might not be very good for me. It's a bit too noisy and quite cramped. I ask this of you, really. I hate to ask this of you, really. But could you maybe arrange for me to have a little private space on the boat? I think it would help me tremendously. And then we could continue our lessons. But nothing too fancy. Just a place to sleep and meditate. With lush greenery, perhaps. <laughs> Oh, and I'd be, delighted if it, I'd be delighted if it had natural stones. Yes, that would be splendid. Thank you again, Stella, deeply. <laughs> Nothing too complicated. But also, here's this very complicated answer. So, what do you? What do, what do we need for you? Oak plank and limestone. And then let's go on to the Mount Toriyama. On to see what we can see. On to believe what we can believe. Looks kind of fancy. Hello, sheep. How you doing? Hmm. Alright. Climb up there or I can go up this way. Nothing over there, so let's climb up the ladder. Ooh, what a spirit we can recruit. Oh, hello there, young lady. How are you doing? Oh, yes, right. Perhaps you can help me. Must have stumbled upon a fluffy sheep in, on the loose down there. I tried getting it back to its enclosure, but he's a stubborn creature. He wouldn't listen to me. 
chance it's on your side. Its weak spot is gluttony, so it will definitely follow anyone who will feed it. Would you be a deer and give it a try? Sure. Where is this sheep? 